What do we use to 3D print human tissue in space? That was one of my biggest questions on my video about the biofabrication facility aboard the International Space Station manufacturing a human knee meniscus. So the biofabrication facility, also known as the BSF, uses human adult cells, such as stem cells or pluripotent cells, and adult tissue-derived proteins. And note, I want to point out the adult piece there because a bunch of questions were asking if it used stem cells from embryos and what exactly the deal was there. First of all, not all stem cells come from embryos. The adult human body still makes stem cells too. And the hope with BFF is that one day you might be able to actually print yourself an organ using your own cells. This is key to reducing the risk of the human body rejecting the organ, which can be even an issue with organ transplant plants today. So these cells and proteins combine together to make up a bio ink that can print viable tissue in microgravity. And once it's printed, it's not just a perfect thing that you can then put into someone's body. It's then cultured in a system that strengthens it over time, so much so that it becomes viable and self-supporting, and ideally it can remain solid once back on Earth. And note that the ISIS National Lab said in 2019 that the prospect of manufacturing hearts and other organs via the 3D bioprinter is likely a decade away. So you won't be able to get an organ from this tomorrow, but the fact that they have made a human demoniscus right now in space is pretty awesome.